Welcome to Kiara Nation. Today we have a very special guest, Tina. Tina from TinaHeals.com. I came to Bombay to work in the films, right? As a writer and a filmmaker, power structure that has been given to us from colonialism, from imperialism, everything is, is made from a Eurocentric view. Even all the documentaries on Indian spirituality is coming from a Eurocentric point of view. So we are sort of being, you know, obliterated out of the equation because we we are immediately focusing on a Eurocentric, heteronormative uh, point of view. We have created a society which is this hetero society which is based on men mm. how to be like a child with someone a submissive is almost like a child mm -hmm. with their uh, dominant esoterically we are all incarnating from the sign of cancer all humanity at this time if i'm going to abuse you i'm going to say you are a cat why why do we use the body parts as something to rock a tree or oh, he's a dick Mm -hmm. Why? A phallus is a beautiful thing, mm -hmm. you know. Or oh, he's a cock. Or oh, he's a cocksucker. I mean, see, society has pinned these into pejorative terms. She's a fucking pussy. Or oh, he's a pussy. Why? Why do you need to equate cowardice with the vagina? There are women enablers who are men. The patriarchy would have us believe that uh, matriarchy did not exist. Sex work is one of the, like, it's the field which is open to magic. It's just open to alchemy. It's, it's physical alchemy. There were women like this in India. Uh, they, they were the temple priestesses. In the sex industry, there needs to be education mm -hmm. because it can be very emotionally taxing. It can be very damaging to the psyche has more nerve endings on her uterus from a vagina to a uterus than a guy can even dream of. And that the feminine body was created to give pleasure. We have genital, uh, uh, female genital mutilation. The minute you take that task from the mundane world into the spiritual world, you give it meaning. Mm -hmm. You give it love. Mm -hmm. You give it a spirit. If you are paying for someone who's coming to you as a sex worker, she's, she is a sex goddess at that point. Because honestly, by assigning strict male and female attributes can be very toxic. Men have to deal with this toxicity as well. The fake, hey, I have the answers to all your questions. No, you don't. So, uh, patriarchy has taught men and women a lot of toxic bullshit. 